Hi there, welcome to another comment help video. In today's guide, we're going to have a look at how you as a referee can add goals, uh, cards, and substitutions to a match where you have been assigned. Cool, so to do this, um, you want to log into a comment. And from there, you should be navigated straight to your My Next Matches where you can find the relevant match. If not, simply expand the referees and officials menu item over here and then select My Next Matches. And from here, you want to then search and find the relevant match for which you want to add match events to. Here, you'll be taken to the main match dashboard. But simply to add match events, you want to add the match events to the relevant team. So let's start with Hamilton Wanderers. You want to select the relevant teams tab. And further down here, you then want to select the relevant person for which we're adding a match event to. So let's say with this person here, you want to add a goal. We'll simply click on the person indicate the type of event that it was, so we're going to say a goal, indicate the time that it happened in minutes, and then select save. Now, if you notice this secondary box here, if the event happened in additional time, so this may be 45 plus 2, or 90 plus 2, or in an extra time, you'll simply indicate the end of the regulation time in the first box, And in the second box, you indicate the additional time. And once done, you can then hit save. Now, if this person has had more than one event added to them, you can just select add, and then from that one there, it adds it up to here, and you can then start adding more events. And then once you're done, add save. Now, for adding cards, exactly the same thing. So find the relevant person. Input the time that it happened, and you would then select either a yellow card or a red card. By selecting either a yellow card or a red card, you finally have the option there to select from the different um, drop down options from Y1 all the way down to Y18. Now, when adding a red card, the only card you'll notice that is, that is missing from them is R9, that being for a second bookable offence. Now the reason R9 is missing is because this card is added in automatically if you add two yellow cards to the same person. So let's give this person a yellow card. We will say to send by word, and then save. And just like that, Done. So now we've added a goal and we've also added a yellow card as well. To do a substitution, you would go down to Substitutes Bench. Now substitutions are identified by they have a line here between the starting 11 and the substitutions and they're also in italics. So select the relevant person that you want to bring on. Indicate the minute that they're coming on. You then select the substitution option, and then from here, select who they're coming on for. And once you're done, you can then select save. Now, if you go back to this person, you'll see that now that the person is subbed on, we've now got the additional options for goal, on goal, and penalty as well. And once you've done the match event for the first team, you would then go and do it for the away team as well. And once you've done then for both the, for both of those teams, the last thing to do is to change the status of this match from being scheduled to then be played. And to do that, you'd go back to the match dashboard, select edit, and then select the played option. And just like that, you've added in the match events for that match and then change the status of that game to play.